Winter is finally here, and I'm not ready. So let's take a vacation to the Italian countryside with Wendy's new Italian mozzarella chicken sandwich. Wait, what? Life gets pretty weird sometimes. You don't always want to cook. So sit down in your chair right there and have yourself a look. We're going through the drive through and getting some fast food. Then we'll eat and talk about if it's bad or good. It's eating fast food in the car and talking about it with Andy. Ugh. Okay, today we are at Wendy's, and yes, you heard correctly, they too have an Italian chicken sandwich. Very similar to Burger King's, but a couple minor changes. Try not to go into this bias, but I think this one's gonna, gonna go a little over the top. So, this chicken sandwich comes with marinara sauce, a puck of fried cheese, which I'm all about, uh, Asiago cheese on top of the chicken, and the bun is like a garlic knot bun. So lots of flavor in here. Uh, also, when I ordered, I was asked if I wanted the chicken regular, grilled, or spicy. So I chose the spicy. So we've got a spicy chicken patty, Asiago cheese, a fried mozzarella cheese puck, uh, marinara sauce on a garlic bun. That sounds delicious. I'm very excited to give this a taste. Right off the bat, there's a lot going on. It's a little dry. It could honestly use a little more sauce. Um, I'm getting the, the spice of the chicken patty. Um, fried mozzarella is very good. I'm getting the garlic from the bun. A lot of flavors working well together here. It's nice, you can see the, the cheese pull. This is basically cheese sticks on top of the sandwich, but in patty form. Um, I think getting this with the spicy, uh, spicy patty was the way to go, because I do feel that spicy chicken heat in the background. Um, I wish there was more sauce. The Burger King version had sauce on the top and bottom bun. There's nothing on the bottom of this bun. It's a little lacking. I don't want it to be dripping in sauce, but uh, like I said, it's a little dry, soaked in a little bit, could use a little more moisture. There's a lot of dry things going on here, a lot of fried things, just it needs a little bit of moisture on here. Other than that, this is really good. Um, the, the fried cheese is a very interesting addition. Um, along with the garlic knot bun a lot of garlic flavor a lot of uh, a lot of Italian flavors here I think of the of the two you know crappy drive-through chicken parms this one was the way to go for sure um, I would a hundred percent recommend this I might go out and get this again it's also available in cheeseburger form too. So you not only can you get this with uh, chicken, fried, grilled, or spicy, you can get it with a with a burger patty. Which I think that sounds interesting. That might solve the moisture problem because the burger would be a little moister, a little greasier. Um, might try that. But uh, it, it, this spicy patty here, yeah, no complaints. This is very, very good. Um, Highly recommend this one, for sure. Now the other thing I saw they had that we had to try today was garlic fries. These are, appear to be very simple. Wendy's fries with a garlic sauce. Um, I've had their uh, Baconator fries before, pretty good. I think they have some type of pub fry right now as well. Garlic fries caught my eye though. I really, really love those. As advertised, garlic and fries. There's a little bit too much of that fake oil, fake butter flavor. I'm talking about kind of like coats your mouth and doesn't taste bad, but you can tell it's just fake oil stuff. I'm getting a lot of that here. 
Definitely get the garlic though. It's not bad. I would say these are as advertised. They are Wendy's fries with garlic sauce on them. It's uh, it's not bad. It's not good. It's what it is. I enjoy them. I don't think I'd get them again. Um, unlike the chicken sandwich that I would get again for possibly next time as the burger. So chicken sandwich gets a thumbs up. Garlic fries, medium thumbs. It is what it is. Could be better, could be worse. It's funny how Burger King and Wendy's come out with very similar sandwiches at the same time. Um, seems to be a trend that like one person will come up with something and the other person does similar things and it's it's all together. I do think I like the Wendy's version of this trend better than BK's. So keep that in mind. Um, I think that is all the time we have today. I'm going to venture back out into the snow and... Uh, Hope for the best. So thank you very much for watching. See you next week.